What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video here on the Samurai Radio Sports Network. And uh, I would like to thank you guys for the kind words in the comments yesterday. Um, I went to Urgent Care this morning. Uh, and thankfully, uh, the great thing there uh, is that my foot is okay. I only have a bruise uh, on my pinky toe, so I can't really walk. I'm on crutches right now, which has never happened to me before. The doctor at urgent care said she doesn't know how i even bruised that part of my foot when i rolled my ankle uh but yeah apparently i'm just a new case it doesn't make any sense there but i wanted to get you guys out of video uh, i'm still in a lot of pain considering the fact that i can't really walk uh i'm really happy that <laughs> there's no classes tomorrow uh for me i only have one class on friday so there's there's at least some good things i just want to go close that tab it was bothering me um, but there's some good things about that. So we are with the Miami Dolphins mock. Uh, I apologize if I don't go. I apologize. Excuse me. If I don't go in depth for a lot of things, uh, turning to look at my computer, I have to keep my foot in an awkward position. So if things start to hurry, if things start to hurry up. Uh, that's why if thing, if you feel like things are going quickly, that's why. And I actually want to just quickly, what's this ultimate GM thing? Do I have to pay for this? Yeah, I do. I don't want to. No, thanks. I'm good. I like to keep my money where it is. So, as always, Dolphins. Seven rounds, of course. Ooh, there's a new one inside the pylon, and it's from today. We'll use that. Uh, I'll go NFL mock. And let's draft. Deshaun Watson goes number one. That's interesting. Miles Garrett. Goes number five to Tennessee. I apologize for my phone. Phone you to shut the fuck up. I'm trying to actually make a video. So please, thank you. Dalvin Cook to the Colts. Zach Cunningham to the Redskins. Obi Mafili Fun. I don't know how the fuck to say that. David and Joko to the Broncos. And then Garen Cunley to the Lions. So let's look at this really quick. I wish I could make this bigger, but oh well. Uh, Deshaun Watson, Jonathan Allen, Mitch Trubisky, Jamal Adams, Miles Garrett, OJ Howard to the Jets at six, Mike Williams to the Chargers, that makes sense, Solomon Thomas to the Panthers, makes sense, Corey Davis to the Bengals, Deshaun Kaiser, Quincy Wilson, Malik McDowell, Cleveland actually had a pretty nice first round there, Reuben Foster, Sidney Jones, Dalvin Cook, Marshawn Lattimore, Zach Cunningham, OB, blah, 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 Cam Robinson, David Njoku, and Garen Conley, I'm surprised that Leonard Fournette's not off the board, same thing with Tim Williams and, uh, to Karis McKinley, or to Karis McKinley, uh, but considering the fact that the best linebacker uh, left right now is on the board, I don't want to get Hassan Riddick. I think I'll wait for a guy like T.J. Watt or Ra Raquan McMillan or even Gerard Davis, and there's a guy I really like on the board right now, and that's Derek Barnett. Therefore, we will be picking Derek Barnett, very talented edge rusher, Forrest Lamp, then Hassan Riddick. Then Marlon Humphrey, Dan Freeney, Leonard Fournette to the Chiefs, to Carson McKinley to the Cowboys, Christian McCaffrey to the Packers, Tease Tabor, Charles Harris, and Taco Charlton. I didn't even see Taco Charlton. Fuck. I didn't see Taco Charlton. Damn it. Malik Cooker drops the second round. So does John Ross and Ryan Ramschick. Dante Freeman early to the Panthers. They're having a pretty good draft. Carl Lawson, Buda Baker, Patrick Mahomes to the Cardinals. Kevin King, Jabril Peppers, Joe Mixon goes early to the Bucks. That would be interesting. And then Ryan Anderson. And, oh, fuck. No, not this again. I think if I reload it, it'll continue. It'll let, unless I can just, uh, I'm just trying to get to draw Davis. Come on. Just, 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 just. Is there any way for me? Oh, okay, I can. So I was going to pick Gerard Davis either way. So picking Gerard Davis, hopefully when it resubmits, it lets us move around. That's the one thing I'd say about fan speak I dislike. And uh, besides that, everything else is pretty Gucci. Is it letting me click now? Okay, it is. I don't know why it wasn't before. Marlon Mack is a guy I really, really like. I'd be interested to see where he goes. Man, my foot. I, I saw a lot of people in the comments telling me about their their foot stories. 
you guys have no idea how much better that made me feel. <laughs> I, <laughs> man, I was in so much pain yesterday. I've, I've gotten hurt before. Obviously, everyone's gotten hurt before. There's no one who's never been hurt. But I'm telling you guys, like, I thought that there was no, like, I've busted my head open. I busted my head open in the third grade. And I think I'm going to go with Jordan Legit, but I'm just checking around here. I busted my head open in third grade. So already that <laughs> that was painful. And I thought to myself, I'm not going to get, like, there's nothing worse than this. Busting my head open, there's nothing worse. Nothing, nothing bad's going to happen besides this. Lo and behold, then I'm playing football over a winter break uh, with some guys from my high school. And, of course, oh, do I want to get Jordan Legit here? Or do I want to grab Jonu Smith later and get, uh, where is he, Demarcus Walker? I'm going to take Demarcus Walker here. Double up on DeLyman. Uh, but I messed up my middle finger on my left hand. And it was like, I'm telling you guys, both these situations, I have no idea how it wasn't broken. I don't know how there wasn't any torn like li like ligaments or anything like that. Like, it makes no sense. Like, there's all these times I'm looking at it, I'm like, damn, I should have broken my finger. Damn, my pinky toe should be broken right now. And it, <laughs> they're not. Like, I don't understand. I guess I'm just built pretty well. I mean, I am a big dude. I'm 6'1", 230. That's not muscle weight. That's weight weight. But um, I guess I'm just a big guy, so I don't know. But... I thought that breaking my head open was bad. Then I thought that my middle finger was bad because then my left hand was useless. Then this, like just trying to use crutches. Like I said, I'm a big dude. Trying to use crutches was, that that was interesting. My mom had to pull the car around. I was like, I'm not a big, I, you guys have seen my videos. I'm not a big dude as in like freaking like huge, super, super, super big. But that shit hurts. They don't, crutches aren't comfortable. That's the first thing. The second thing, this is just not fun. Like, <laughs> it's just not. That's probably the worst pain I've ever felt because then, like, I don't know if anyone else has been on crutches. I'm sure a lot of people have. But I feel like you just feel worthless. Like, I was telling my mom, I'm like, I just, I'm going to grab a key. Ah, wait. Let me, before I continue this, do I double, triple up and grab Josh Caraway? Or... Huh. I like bowl wear. I'm going to grab a corner here and a kilo with a spoon like I always do. But I was telling my mom, I was like, man, I feel worthless. Like, when you can't walk, oh, my God. That's probably the worst feeling I've ever had is not being able to walk. Oh, I like this. I forgot we have three fifth-round picks. So I can get whoever the fuck I want. But I hated it. Suggestion. Just don't do anything. Never get injured. <laughs> That's my suggestion for life. Don't do anything. Don't get injured. This pain, like the pain I feel. Like right now they wrap my foot. So it's been feeling better. But <sighs> I was like, I was at urgent care. And this lady was uh, the one who was like more so taking care of me most of the time. She was looking at me because I was like hopping around. And she goes, are you sure you don't want a wheelchair? And then until I realized, like, the distance I was going to have to go to get to where the x-ray room was because they wanted to x-ray my uh, ankle, I was like, no, nah, I'm fine. So I'm just hopping around, and she's looking at me like, what is this kid on? Like, he's got to be on some type of drug. Like, this dude is hopping around, <laughs> and it's not hurting his leg, like, just going up and down and hitting. I was I was perfectly fine. And when I saw, like, uh, how far I was going to have to go... I'm going to grab a receiver here and Stacy Cook. Actually, I'm going to go Travis. No, I'll go homegrown talent. Um, when I saw, like, how far it was to get to the x-ray room, I was like, shit, whatever. Just get me the wheelchair. I'm f I I'll, I'll sit in the wheelchair. Even then, I'm like, damn. Like, it's pretty comfortable. I wish that they would have given me a wheelchair. Honestly, I could do a wheelchair. But crutches? I fucking hate it. Dude, I hate it so much. Never, never again. I'm never going to play sports. Fuck it. I'm just going to sit at home and play games all day and just edit. At least I won't get hurt that way. Fuck! Ben Bulware just went. But I still got Matt Milano. I feel like 
I'm sorry that this one wasn't going in depth to all the picks and everything, but you guys gotta understand I'm in a lot of pain. I wanted to tell the story of how it happened. I thought it was pretty interesting. I thought you guys would enjoy it. So yeah. So I hope you enjoy me going off talking about random things. But we'll go over our picks uh, a little bit. So I grabbed Derek Barnett. I didn't see Taco Charlton or uh, Carl Lawson, so I don't understand how the f- I don't know, but whatever. Uh, so we grabbed Derek Barnett. I think that's a slam dunk pick. Then we grab a good uh, inside outside linebacker and Gerard Davis. I think another slam dunk pick. Then we grab Demarcus Walker, who's a great. You could you could either be a DT or DN. It's great for me. Great slam dunk pick there. We get the six three beast in Akilo Witherspoon. I always gotta draft that man's. Uh, then we get Josh Caraway. Then we go grab two homegrown talents. We grab FIU's John New Smith. Then we grab Miami's Stacy Coley. And then we grab Boston College Matt Milano, who's a little more of a shorter guy, uh, but I really like him. Just so you guys know, uh, I'm working on another one of these videos. I'm thinking the next person I'm going to do uh, is going to be uh, Taco Charlton. So just letting you guys know on that. Another thing, I will be calling into Finsider Radio today. So if you guys don't follow Finsider's Radio, I will be calling in. Hopefully, my uh, call gets taken. Don't worry about my Abby. That's one of my friends. I like to make fun of her. Uh, I like to meme her face. So if you guys don't already follow Finsider, you don't watch it at all. Uh, I listen to it playback sometimes. Sometimes I don't. But uh, if you guys want to hear me, mostly, hopefully I'll be on. Hopefully they take my call today. Uh, I think Aaron told me he's going to. So hopefully my call gets taken. We can talk some stuff. It's only going to be on for 30 minutes. It's at 930 EST. So hope you guys tune in uh, and i hope you guys will enjoy it but i hope you guys enjoyed this video uh besides that yeah just something that's some thomas duarte watching some cause stuff just enjoying it i don't have school tomorrow like i said so i'm pretty happy with that i have school on friday um i'm most likely not going to go to work the next couple of days so my paycheck's going to be slight which sucks because i'll just be at work worthless I, whatever We'll see, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, most likely tomorrow, if my foot's feeling a lot better, I'll just be making videos the entire day so you guys will get content out over the weekend so I can just rest, keep my leg up, and uh, just chillax. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'm going to sit here. I have some dolphin videos to edit, and then I have some videos I need to do and make. As you see, I'm rendering a dolphin video right now. Hopefully, it's going to get to my uh, Adobe Premiere Pro soon. And I'm, I've also been playing Minecraft a lot lately. Don't judge me. But I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like the video. I apologize for this being laid back. Hopefully, they said it's 7 to 10 days, which means next Tuesday I should be fine. I heal pretty fast with a lot of these things. My like my pinky, or not my pinky, my middle finger, like everyone was looking at it. They're like, yeah, to get it checked up. I'm like, ah, this looks fine. And it healed within like just about a week, not even. So I, I should be fine and good to go. So... Hope you guys did enjoy. I also will be working on the mock draft. I'm doing three rounds. Hopefully, I'll have that out sometime, if not tomorrow, then the next couple days. So, hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure you like the video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. And as always, peace.